week leading into your fight for, for Team Alpha Male with Paige and with Chad. I'm just curious your thoughts on, on Chad's loss in particular. Um, you know, just how do you feel about that? It's just, uh, it's really frustrating. I mean, you know, these four ounce gloves that anything can happen and, and uh, props to Frankie, man. Frankie is, you know, he's the guy that doesn't quit training, he doesn't stop progressing, he doesn't take time off. And um, that could have been anybody's exchange. He, he, he clipped him in a, in a real strange way. It was just right on the, nicked his upper lip and, and put Chad down. It's, it's sad for Chad because, uh, I mean, there's a lot of buildup. I mean, after you saw how he was in two weeks' notice with Connor, you know, stepping in there, his fight with Aldo, um, you know, Chad, people were going to be jumping out of the weight class and doing this and doing that. I would love to see Chad stay in there and uh, get another shot with, with, with Frankie coming up or um, do something big. And it was, you know, I was thinking about that in my fight. I need to get morale up and it was motivating for me. I mean, that's one of the coolest things about being a part of a team is it's, it's more than just you. It's somebody, you know, you have a family, you have a support system. And, yeah, it was rough. And after your guy won the Ultimate Fighter, can you admit that you actually like Connor? <laughs> yeah, I like Connor. <laughs> Connor's a good guy. We actually we had we had some good times in Vegas. Uh, you know, not that he can't get on your nerves, but uh, I enjoy I enjoy his mindset. He's he's a uh, he's a special guy. And and uh, man, really really feel for Aldo. What a big champion. You know, hopefully he gets his chance. I mean, I think Frankie's up next, but. Hopefully he gets his chance for redemption, but um, man, can't argue with Connor, dude. The Mystic Mac. Thank you. All right, we'll be back in a few minutes with Connor. Thanks, guys.